This presentation addresses clinical questions on the Somnident Avant straps. Somnident Avant components include an upper plate with a strap clip at the anterior, a lower plate with two hinges located on either side. These plates are connected and held in position by the strap. Each strap is marked with an identifier for its size. Somnident Avant's novel advancement mechanism involves the interchange of different length straps to provide protrusion. Higher number straps advance the mandible and lower number straps provide retrusion of the mandible. How do I choose the right strap size for the patient? Somnident Avant is supplied with either a small, medium or large strap kit. Each strap kit includes 10 straps, from the negative one millimeter to the positive eight millimeter providing a total range of 9mm. The choice of starting strap, L0, M0 or S0, is made by the Somnomed technician during manufacture. It is driven by the patient anatomy, their arch shape and size, and the total amount of protrusion in the supplied bite record. Why are there different strap sets? In early user feedback, we supplied 20 straps. The feedback was that this was confusing to patients and difficult to monitor protrusion. Therefore, Somnident Avant is supplied with a small, medium or large set of 10 straps, providing a total range of 9mm. Advancement from the supplied bite record matches the strap ID. Additional strap sets are available where straps need to be replaced or a patient needs to transition to another strap set. How should I be taking the protrusive bite record? As with Somnomed's existing products, we recommend taking a protrusive bite using SomGauge to ensure that there is three millimeters of vertical clearance between the two closest opposing cusps across the arches. Somnident advanced strap sets provide one millimeter of retrusion and eight millimeters of advancement. If for patient comfort reasons, more than one millimeters of retrusion from the supplied bite record is required, the device may need to be remade and the patient fitting delayed. Therefore, to simplify the fitting process, we advocate a protrusion setting of 60% of full protrusion. With eight millimeters of protrusive settings, let the straps do the work. How are the straps placed on or taken off? To attach a strap, hold the upper plate and press the white collar of the strap into the strap clip. Slide the strap around until the center is inside the strap clip. Hold strap so it is upright. Press the right strap hole over the right hinge. Hold finger over the right hinge and repeat for the left hinge. Rotate the strap down so the plates meet. To remove a strap, rotate the strap until it is upright. With the strap upright, pull it off the right hinge. Repeat for left hinge. Slide strap around until strap clip is at the white marking on the strap. Pull the strap out of the strap clip. 